Hey folks, Quill18 here, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Hearts of Iron 4! We're playing as Yugoslavia, we've recently taken over the UK over here, and Ireland. And we do have to deal with a minor counterattack by the Allies down here, but I think that should hopefully be relatively easy to deal with. They are piling lots of troops. It's one of the things, uh, we haven't really seen that in a little while, but the AI did get tuned pretty dramatically in the last patch to... Uh, actually commit when it does a naval invasion um, wherever possible. So they are landing a ton of different dudes over here uh, to get some things going on. Let's go ahead and advance you over here. We should be able to do a bit of a counter bop because uh, we've got some cut off. Ooh, no, it's going to be uncut off in a second, which is a little too bad. But still, actually, let's move you directly in there to recut this guy off if we can. Make sure to start that combat. So that hopefully we can get there before he retreats to it and overrun. Maybe not. Oh well. Anywho, uh, is that you? Your no, your response over here. Go. And there might be too much for us to do with here. Let's go ahead and cancel the front line. Let's go and set a new offensive line over here. And perhaps we will want to retreat troops out of the UK here. There's not really much sense in having everyone here. They're going to have to go and, and work to invade North America, but we might want to muscle up a bit more. Let's go ahead and do that uh, from this group here. I'm going to take... Uh, I mean, we might even want some tanks to push back here. What I think I'm going to do is, since I have no manpower, some of these, like, super green guys with no experience points, I'm actually going to go ahead and disband some of these to free up... Uh, whoa. One, one's encircled? Who's encircled? Okay, yeah, good. How's one of those guys encircled? I don't know. Anyway, if I do this, are you going to be sensible with your movement? Or are you going to be suicidal? Oh, um, I, I was using the Irish guys for this. Uh, I guess that's fine. Yeah, so you're going to be spending probably too much time at sea. I hate that you can't queue movement up from port to port. Okay, I'm going to move you guys to this instead. Work your way to Dublin, then we'll just cross a little bit more safely. Because I, I kind of want to hop you to here, and then hop you across, and then go. Um, I should probably grab some people from this division as well, and do something similar. Put you in a separate group. Just go ahead and strategically redeploy you to here, and then I'll get you to cross over and help with the push pushback. I don't think that we want the tanks to be part of the actual amphibious assault on North America anyway. So it's okay if they wait. So we'll just hold this border for now until some tanks arrive. Because, yeah, there's there they did land a good number of things over here. It'd be great if Republican Spain actually joined us. I mean, they're full-on communists. By the way, we've been influencing Brazil for a while. They are getting very close to potentially flipping over to communists. Doesn't mean that they're actually jo going to join Team Awesome. But they might. Um, are you... We're not able to get there? I guess not. This is all derp. This is all forbidden territory. So this is completely, like, disconnected now. To get to here, we'd have to go through Libya. And there's nothing in the south. Alright, then you know what? You guys are going to strategically redeploy to here and be able to join this counterattack. This is a division is nearly uh, a regular unit, which is going to be nice to see. So yeah, we can just afford to be a little bit more patient. Okay, your response, you're there, so I'm going to tell you to, uh, not that, there you go, minimal amount of time at sea, likewise, you're going to cross over that way. I mean, there's still, you know, some enemy destroyers, some enemy subs, but we've got a lot of other ships to protect our stuff, so I think we're going to be fine. Now, I might be overkilling things at this point. To, to fight back, but what else are we going to do, right? Still haven't figured out exactly how I'm going to deal with these islands. So let me just worry about this first. Come on, make it over. You can do it. I have faith in you. There you go. Okay, so now I can tell you, hey, just join part of this fun over here. 
currently being pushed back. We don't have a ton of organization. I don't think we've completely reloaded from the strategic redeployment, maybe some of our earlier attacks. But we should be able to, to buff up this line pretty well. Um, this group here, you're good, so you're going to tell you to strategically redeploy to here. We've got some free civilian factories. So... What do we want? Right, we got a shortage of tactical bombers, but that's not entirely accurate. It's mostly based on the fact that we're not... Um, we're, we've got some deployed and we've never actually bothered building any. We don't truly have any. I'm going to queue up for some more strategic bombers. I think that's going to be okay. Okay, you don't actually have the free civilian factories. You're just lying to me. Look, look, it's all... How, where are you? The, oh, civilian. Not military. Civilian. Really? Wow, we've repaired most things so well already? Well, Jeebus. Okay, let's um, let's build some nuclear reactors. Whole bunch. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to build up the infrastructure here, and I'm going to put this up on top of the queue just so that we can get... I, I Although, no, it's not actually worth it. I'm being a little bit foolish here. Yeah, hold on. It's You don't actually save time by building infrastructure first. I mean, unless there was a bunch of empty spots, then maybe, but we it's not like that. So um, We actually might want to build a ton of naval dockyards, though. Let's assume we've got control over some of this stuff. I don't know if that's true or not. Start to look at maybe producing ships a little faster. We'll do the nukes first. That's going to be fine. All right, more guys have arrived. How about you? You're, uh, you're, oh, you're there, so you can cross to here. Excellent. So right now we're just looking to hold this line. Mostly, probably. That's the idea, anyway. I don't know who was trying to attack there. There may have been some movement queued from before. Just hold the line. Prep the battle plan. Actually, I'm going to change the offensive line here to actually explicitly go all the way to the back. There's your battle plan. So get your prep, and then these new tanks have just landed here. Excellent. So I'm going to get them to join in as well. So we're going to have eight modern tank divisions ready to push through all this nonsense. That's going to be pretty good. We have the general here who's got the mountaineer, which is going to be pretty relevant because this is actual mountain territory over here. So I mean, it's still not the idealist Idealist? Sure. Idealist kind of territory to attack into, but it's not going to be too bad. So you just keep training for now. I mean, I don't know if you'll actually be able to get an XP level in a reasonable amount of time. So it's sort of pre-war stuff. But we've got the material, so we may as well do it. Your response. Okay, everyone's basically there. We just have to wait for these guys to actually get some org. And then we'll probably tell them to go. These guys' orgs have been reset as well. Because Why are they... See, I don't know why some of these guys are moving forward. They're not, they haven't been told to attack. Oh, it's our... Um, it's our MPs that are trying to attack. Well, at least some of it, that's what that is. No, some of our actual divisions are going. Well, you know what, then? I'm going to tell everyone to go at this point, because... Because some people are attacking, so we may as well get them fully supported. Uh, let me should get some planes over here. Airplanes. So, we need, first of all... God, this list is insane. Um... That's close air support? Yes. We're going to go with uh, 1, 2, 100 close air support, and jet fighters. 1, 2, 100 jet fighters in here as well. Uh, we don't have any manpower. Okay, hold on a sec. You. Done. Okay, let's try that again. Jet fighters are one, two. Excellent. So everyone's going to be deployed to here. Uh, normal air superiority, close air support. Get a bit of a bonus to our combat. This is being kind of tough as is here. This is being a lot less effective than one would hope. Okay. Tell you what. Stop on the attack after all. Some of us have a fair amount of planning, but not everyone. So, let's let that accrue. Also, okay, the manpower situation is not as good as expected. Let's cancel a few more of these. The guys, again, with, like, very little XP. Let's 
trash a whole bunch of space. Strategic destruction is done. Let's go ahead and get the final level in our air doctrine. At least they're being attrition right now, so that's going to help us. And at least the tanks have a whole lot of experience. Oops, we're paused. So yeah, let's go ahead and get that. let them get their planning bonus. Uh, we are still... No, we did deploy all of our garrisons over here. That's good. Escort carriers are also done. Um, destroy organization and escort efficiency. I think we need to keep going down that. That's, that's still well valuable. I don't think I've used nukes in this game before, so there's a good chance that I'm, like, missing some important prep step for the nuke, but we'll see how it goes. So, yeah, we haven't told these guys to actually start attacking yet. Like, they've got their offensive plans, but I, I don't know. I think it must be the MPs. And then the other troops are like, oh, I better help. Um, there we go. Hopefully that'll stop that kind of behavior. We'll just have to remember to add them back in here afterwards. Okay. Org's good. Strength's not all there. Are you missing equipment? You're missing manpower. But that's being reinforced now. Okay, good. Yeah, so that's the other thing. These guys were not fighting at full strength because there was a slight issue with getting manpower. But that's happening now. Um, Who are you? Oh, right! All the African units. They've made their way over here now. And keep going with the strategic redeployment as close as possible. So then we'll have wicked amounts of overkill here. These garbage are about to level up, so... Um, yeah, well, I mean, we'll leave everyone who's at the front in place. But I think we should be able to push these guys back. Nuclear bombs are done! Allow nuclear bombs. Okay, well, so this is entirely done. Industry, we're still fine with. We could get, like, more levels of oil plants. And we might still. I guess, well, we're not building tack bombers. We may, we might want to research that at some point. What year is it? Do I want to start way ahead of time research in the next level of bombers? I might, actually. So we're not using the subs. Um, we are doing battleships. So I guess we'll get started on that. That's okay. Low manpower, I know. So, nuclear reactor is built. Total production speed, 1% per day. Next nuclear bomb will be ready in 90 days. Well, that's not too bad. If we can get a nuke every three months? Shit. Now, I know we need total air superiority over a site before we do anything. Oh, you need to be a field marshal. My bad there. Alright, more troops are getting in position. Or I could pull a couple of people out, because it still might be good to have the mountain guy. Like, what if I just did that? What if I took, say, you, you, and you, and put you in a separate group? There we go. And then we can keep the mountain general. There should be some other general, although you've got the panzer leader. Oh, you're panzer leader and mountaineer. You know what? Hold on. Let's do a little swap. Uh, unassigned. Because you're level 6, but... We do have a lot of tanks, so let's do that. And I guess we'll use the level 6 one over here. Or we could get use the level 2. Maybe we can end up giving him an extra trait. So you're going to go, and your front line will be here. And you'll be there to help that push. Or something. Okay, that might be better. Meanwhile, these marines... Oh yeah, they're going to level up. Excellent. We can get them to regular before we make another push over here. There may or may not be a ton of people here left, because they, they tried to move, they tried to do things, they might have shuffled around, there's all sorts of possibilities. They may have disappeared. They may all be over here for some reason. The AI really likes to like pile a ton of troops on this island. Alright. I think we might be good to go here. A lot of our units have max prep. Some of them don't. Because they just still arrived, but uh, we've actually got the green check mark over here, so I'm inclined to start moving. There we go, and you as well. Just push up there. Not every combat's going to be successful, but a lot of them are, including some overruns somehow. I don't know we got that, but holy crap! Are we killing you so fast you're not able to retreat? Is that possible? There are mountains, and they may not have had total organization. How do you? It must be something like that. 
It's just, like, insane attack speed. You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get attack bombers. Whatever. I don't care. Because when we get the jet ones, it might be handy. You make sure to grab that territory there. It's gonna annoy me if we don't do that. If we grab down here, we're gonna get a nice cutoff on all these guys, although they'll probably try to run, but I can definitely foresee more overruns happening. Go, 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 go. Taking the city is going to be a little trickier, but looks like... Um, no, we still happened, because we were going to get the surround at some point, and we would have gotten then the encirclement bonuses, which would have been pretty spiffy. Or, not in literal encirclement in this case, but it would have been like the multi-direction attack. Uh, that is... Um, that is quite convincing of a counterattack here. Let's make sure to remember to re-garrison this area. Boom. Excellent. Good job, your response. So, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to move all these tank divisions to somewhere in central France. And these guys, I don't know, I'll move up to here or something like that. And we don't have to worry about them for a while. Outdated equipment in progress. Naval bombers. Oh. Rank threes, yes. How come it doesn't... There it is. Now we could do some experience upgrades, but we don't have that much kicking around. Okay. We are starting to get a lot of fighters. Like, we might want to scale back on the fighter production. The thing is, you kind of need, like... You really need a ridiculous amount to be able to, to win this out. Uh, where's our planes over here? And what's the status? Okay, we've got full air superiority. If I take a look at my marines, you guys are now regulars. Uh, I don't think you can train them up to the next... I guess you can. We might be able to get them all the way up to an even more elite group. And that might be critical here. I don't know. Available planes. I mean, tons of planes, really. Could put the transports away. Um, what else we got here? We have tons of different, like, and super obsolete close air support. Let's go and throw them in here, because they could do naval strikes, port strikes. And if there's any combat, you can join in there. That's going to be okay. Uh, Ireland! They are trying to invade over there, but we have actual, real, true, strong forces here to fight back. I think that's going to be fine. It's not just garrison-type troops, but actual military. They're trying to invade from there. I'm hoping that if they're trying to invade from there, that might mean they're not present um, over here, for example. I don't know if that's true. Again, not having the vision sort of sucks. I wonder if I should get them all the way up to max skill before we go. Probably. Hell, it's possible we'll go to max skill and they'll still just get stack wiped instantly. And that would be a bit upsetting. I don't know. We might just have to deal with it. Okay, everything is still fine here. Apparently we got some planes over here. Uh, let's go ahead and get rid of you. Anywhere else we got planes down here? I don't think so. Any planes over here? I mean, unless we can't select them this far, but I'm going to guess we don't have any. Uh, ooh, that is quite the reinvasion of India here. Sin Kang might be able to deal with them. I don't know. We'll, uh, we'll keep an eye on things. But it's pretty far for us to respond to. Not that we're doing a ton of stuff with our troops. All right, I'm going to stop the training. I I'm going to want to go here. We had a fair amount of air force. We've got our ships nearby for some convoy escorting. If we can start grabbing these islands, it'd be good. I mean, I could just skip this one and go to the next one, but I want to deny these naval bases too. That's a big part of what's going on here. Um, I could build a radar up here for maybe a little bit more info as well, and it wouldn't be the worst idea in the universe. They don't take that long to build. And actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to queue up a max level radar station in the Highlands. Because it's also going to help us keep an eye on the seas. Have a cruiser level 2. Let's go to level 3. And yeah, what we may end up doing is nuking the U.S. Because it, it will destroy their national unity. 
and allow that war to go a lot faster. Part of me still wonders if we should declare war on Sweden. <laughs> just to, like, and, and Finland, just to bring them into our, our sphere here. Ireland, a new landing. I'm not actually concerned about that. That's okay. How's India looking? Um, okay, they're still, they're mostly going to be halted. It wouldn't surprise me if we can't push them back, but as long as their ex expanse is halted there. Ooh. They retake Calcutta. You know what? We may actually have to go and assist. I don't know about with everyone. It's a big movement, but... All right, you know what? Let's do it. Get over there and see. Uh, Northern Ireland. Now, we should have... Actually, we don't have maybe the numbers to guard everything in Northern... Um, so, Ireland, Northern England. Although, apparently, Northern England is here. That doesn't seem quite right. And if we did want to reinforce with real strong people, we'd have to do something over here. I don't know. Let's see what happens. So I can move this Euro response back over here. Oh no, we do still have some teal. That's right, we've got these troops over here. You know what? Uh, do I want to exercise these guys? Let's do it. Okay, that looks like that's been stopped over here. Keep in mind, if they get attacked while they're exercising, they've got no no prep. We're gonna have to like resolve that pretty quickly. But I think it's worth doing a little exercise. Maybe not with the regulars, because they're already there. We've got the equipment, that's the thing. We're, we're not worried about spending the equipment doing the exercise. Alright, Marines. Let's come up with a plan. This to there, we'll lock you in. We'll get everything in position. I don't think you get any kind of planning bonus 